Well, it sounds like something in a chemistry experiment. If all goes well, it could result in a new way of fixing Hawaii's roads. Dallas Ontiveros explains from Kapolei. This morning, HDOT is working with a new concrete mix injected with CO2 to not only improve our infrastructure, but to help our environment. When you look at how much we're, we're putting into production for all the roads that we have, for all the bridges that we have coming up, for all the homes that have new slabs coming through, for all the buildings that we need the concrete for, it can turn into quite a, bit, quite a big amount of CO2 that we can either entrain into the concrete or avoid producing. That's the whole goal today. The testing of the concrete mix is not only cost efficient, but an example in how to save energy. You take a little bit of cement out of this mix, you put carbon cure back into it, and that gives you the same strength. But what I'm looking for is to do that, the savings on the cement versus uh, the cost of the carbon comes out even, so it's neutral. And then you're environmentally friendly. We reduce it overall by about 1,500 pounds into the environment. Now, that doesn't sound like a lot, but really that's equal to about one car driving 1,600 miles on the highway continuously. So it, it builds up quite a bit. The results could take up to a week, but the outcome is focused on Hawaii's future. Because it doesn't just uh, impact Department of Transportation. It's anybody who does development, anybody who uses concrete can start using this technology at a, at a no-cost change. Dallas Naveros, KHON2 News.